Today I'll be talking you through the Triple Eight control panel. Back in the day, I don't know if you remember, Larry Perkins used to have the Tower of Power, which is this massive plate with all the switches and buttons on it. It was actually, it was actually a really good thing because you could access it from behind and everything was uh, really easy to get to if you had a, an issue during the race. But with, um, with switches, with fuses and everything like that now being completely automatic or, or, uh, or, they, com or they automatically reset themselves, um, there's no need for that big tower of power. So what it's been reduced down to is just a small little keypad, um, which is nice and low down beside the, uh, the driver's ARB positions. So uh, we'll run through a few controls and what they do. This is the master switch. So this is uh, the switch, you pull the uh, missile button up, push that switch forward, and that'll turn the car on. That'll give it all power. Uh, to turn the ignition then on, same thing again, push forward for the ignition to go on. Now, if I hit the start button, the car will start up and run. No need for a key. There's no key in a supercar, so there's no uh, no risk in losing your key on the way to the track. Uh, so run through the other switches. We've got this guy here, and uh, he's the CPS light for soft tyres. So every time I have soft tyres on, I need that button there on. Uh, this is the co-driver CPS light. So every time Lounsey drives a car, he needs to have the green light on. We've got the fuel rail bleed. This is basically only used for the mechanics to make sure that the system is fully bled before I go out. Helmet fan, that's the, the um, tube that connects into the top of my helmet. This guy up here, he'll go straight in the top of the helmet for me to turn the fan on is that button. Cool suit switch. This guy here is the cool suit full of dry ice. Uh, if I want to turn that on, it's that button there. Alternator, if I have an issue with the alternator during the race and it's not charging the battery properly, I can hit that button just to make sure that it uh, it charges the battery. Cockpit lights, they're used for the night races. So we've got a little, we don't have it installed at the moment, but a, a black light, like you see on the forensic movies, black light on top here, lights up the whole dash and, uh, and all the labels that you want to see. Headlights, um, turn the headlights on full time. The windscreen wipers on full time as well. Got the rain light here as well down the bottom. If any time you have got wet tires on, doesn't matter if it's wet or dry or raining or not, you need to have the rain light on. And this guy down here is our indicators, left and right indicator. So um, it's, uh, it's a very simple, only use that to come in and out of the pit. So that's a basic rundown of the control panel. Hopefully you've learned something.